Hello everyone. I have tried to make videos um, and explain some things that's been going on in my life, but words can't, um, it would take too many words. You know, I didn't burden anyone through these years with all that I had going on, all that I had put off, and in short, I am very overwhelmed by the world and the cares that I have because I've always carried a lot. Um, and now this is the biggest test of all because I have more than anyone could bear on me. Um, that's the world. And that I know that I'll get through this time because I am ordained to get through this time. And that's what's kept me going my whole life. I've always had more than most could bear on me. I guess it's any who don't think of their self, who only think of others, they have a lot to bear. And um, I've had a lot of things going, you know, wrong. I mean, I didn't, you know, I had to become tough in this world that I could survive. And um, I just, there's so many things I haven't shared with you. And, um, you know, while I can just say in short, I've tried to make videos, this is so hard. You know, I haven't showed the real me, the real, real me in a long time. But I, you know, even my children, there's things that they have missed out on because of my trial. But through these years, these last years, a lot in the world's falling apart because when I was receiving, you know, the revelation and everything, what I waited my whole life for, I mean, there was just, I, there's no words that can, I, you know, to even go back and think of all that was given to me and understood and just, there's no words to say, all I can do is use what has been given to me. Um, but my son, I've had so much that got broken in these years that now I have to fix. You know, and um, my son has is needs me, but I had to be fixed before I could help him. Um, I'm going to tell my testimony because that's what my life is for. And right, you know, with the YouTube and everything, everything, I never meant to not speak with some people. I just, everything got too much for me. The YouTube, when they did that last upgrade and they put everything together, I am lost in my mail. And now it's telling me I have no room. I just have, so everything in my life has just fallen out of order. But I have what I need to put it all back. It's just not, it's just feeling like I failed some out there, that I wasn't there. You know, some who... I just can't explain all things. Just know it's been very rough. But it will all work out for good. All the suffering will work out for good. You know, there's just so much I've seen wrong spoken on YouTube. And I, there's just so many minds and voices out there. I'm going to give the, my voice. You know, and I'm going to, but, you know, I, I know everything promised to me will be fulfilled. Um, I never meant to not be there for some of you out there. Just know that right now there's no words that I can... I've just held in my whole life everything. And then these three years, basically everything I've held in. And I had no one to help me. No one, you know... In, in my life, you know, I actually had a lot against me this whole time that this was happening. I've had a lot against me in my own life, but I know it will all be done as it, as it should. Um, it's not by my power that I will 
you know, these things will be accomplished in my life. I'm just going to, you know, tell all that I've held in. I'm going to tell my testimony. Um, so many, they are out there teaching on YouTube. We're not here to teach. You're here to testify to things that is right. That the things that are not right can will be manifest. You know, I stopped seeking after what was, you know, people are seeking after the Antichrist and all these things that, darkness that they seek after. I chose to seek after what is good and right and seek the kingdom. If I find what's good, I'll know what is not of the good. My life is for this. This is all my life is for. Um, and this is when you when when you know so many out there have are not prepared to hear. You know, it's hard to say anything without offending. And um, even some of those who have agreed with me will probably be offended in some things I say. But, um, I just lost my train of thought. Um, I'm not, I will think of, I have to block out all those minds and, you know, I have to just know why I'm speaking and who I'm speaking to. You know, I will speak what I know, and it's it, whatever, whoever out there will hear or not hear or accept or not accept, I, I can't think of that. I have to just, you know, because when, when, when I have put out some videos and, and, and got some emails from people, I mean, year, even years ago, you know, how they had waited and was so happy to hear the things that I spoke because that was the spirit bearing witness to them. And and there was so there's so few that is speaking truly and honestly, even many who think they are. You know, there come a time just months ago when after so much had been given to me little by little, it was I did you know, it was little by little. I was being filled with what is right and true, little by little. That falsehood taken out, that was, I came to the point, after so much to begin, I had many questions at first, but the more I received, the less questioning, you know. And then I got to the point where I'd watch a video, and I would automatic, and I still, this is how it is today, but, um, where I'd, I watch a video, and I see the right and wrong as soon as it's spoken. It just jumps out. You understand this person's holding on to this certain doctrine, this certain teaching. You know, they might speak many things right here, but they are holding on to this, and that's where they don't. And I've said it before. My, my word has no place in you. If you are filled with it, wherever you are holding to those carnal ideas and doctrines and images and, you know, understandings of man, at the carnal mind, anywhere that you're holding on that, you cannot attain the truth in that area. So what many are doing is they, because they, had, they have not let that be consumed from them, they speak many things, and, the, and they're, but they're out there, they mix it with that carnal. So their truth has become a lie. Because no lie is of the truth. That's why I... I've waited my whole life to speak. And there's some things that people are just fearful to let go. And it it has been a great deception. But it is that we would learn through it. I won't I won't accept any lie. And I won't speak a lie. Not that if I can help it. That's why I don't speak things until I know, until I have full assurance in what I am speaking. I am not a teacher. I am here to bear, bear witness. My witness that I have 
learned on my own, seen these things myself. This is not from no man. I have received nothing from me. And the letter has been consumed from me. So, but this is not, you know, my work. It's not by my power that it be done. It wasn't by my power that kept me alive my whole life till this day. And I've always known I'll be alive until my work is done. And I'm still not sure. I still don't understand myself totally. But I know that these things have been in my mind and heart every second of my life. That, and now more so, because now with understanding, I mean, I've just waited. My whole life has just been a trial and a, and a tarrying. So, for, and I just want, you know, forgive me for not being here. Just, I, the last thing I wanted to do is let anyone down. And for anyone to think that I put them off, or because I did not by any means do that on purpose. It's just my life has a lot going on and a lot coming on me right now. More than I, I, I don't want to burden anyone with my problems, you know, with my troubles. I would know I will get through them. But the biggest trouble is not speaking. That is my biggest trouble is, you know, not being able to speak, coming and. How many videos I've made in this last month that I get it made and finally think, okay, that's good, I can put it out. And then it don't load, <laughs> you know. Um, I've just had a lot of troubles, but I'm working on them, and I'm still here. And um, I will post that other, um, forgive me, Sis Lively, for not responding to the last comment, because I wasn't... Um, I'm so overwhelmed just by everything. I, there's many that I haven't replied to. But um, usually I don't reply to that when someone, because I wait for a perfect time where I can, you know, reply rightly, you know, and give a good reply to somebody. But, but then that time never comes. So it, I end up seeming like I just put them off and I really did not mean to. Um, I think of all of you. Every day, I think of everyone out there, and, um, but I'm not, I, I changed it. I'm just going to delete that other one I had said I created, and I made another one, which I believe it's one, I believe I called it, and I'll post it. Um, I believe I put one ordained and authorized witness, or one authorized and ordained witness, but I'll post it, and that's where I'm going to begin. I'm going to put it back, everything you know, in my in my life. I don't know if I'll still post on here, but I'm going to begin little by little. I need to start fresh. My Everything needs fresh in it to be fresh and in order in my life. I got my work cut out for me, believe me. <laughs> um, I just know that what people must think of me just disappearing and, you know, just know I've been through a trying time. And I love you all. Bye for now. Many blessings.